Okay, so guys, so on Friday, we got news of the Bears trading the number one overall pick to the Carolina Panthers. But the Carolina Panthers had a number nine pick. So it wasn't like they just had to go up like one or two picks. Like they had a, you know, they had they didn't have the best. Like they weren't the best team, but they weren't like horrible. Yeah, like horrible, horrible. Yeah, like number nine's not too good, but it's not like what are you doing out there, bad. Yeah, like, and as a Bears fan, I am happy they traded it, <laughs> cause uh, Justin Fields. If you got, if you guys go see my Madden video, uh, which I made today with the with the Bears and the franchise. I said that Justin Fields was my favorite player in it. Um, but uh, yeah, he he is my favorite NFL player. So, I, and there was rumors that they were actually going to trade him. So, you know, if they traded him, <laughs> I don't think I would really trust the Bears. Because Justin Fields has been very good for the Bears in the past when he's gotten an opportunity to be a very good. So, like, I'm not saying that he's going to become Tom Brady, come the GOAT. Yeah. This is my favorite college. Here is here's my favorite team in all sports. And I would not want to see Bryce Young in this. I mean I would be fine if 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 when Justin Fields retires, if Bryce Young is still if Bryce Young is still in the NFL, I'd be fine if the Bears pick him up if he's been doing very good and they don't want to resign him because he wants like a big contract like two hundred, three hundred mil, but a million. But um, I don't. I, they did the right move by not trading him now because Justin Fields has been very good for him though in the past. Yeah, like, when he's gotten an opportunity to be a star, and they got it. And they got a top 20 wide receiver in the NFL in DJ Moore. And DJ Moore has not had the best QBs over his career. So, now, this has, this is big for Justin Fields to determine, will he be good or bad? Like, if he's good with, with DJ Moore, and if he gets, if they get another wide receiver with the, Drafting, which they probably won't. Do. I hope they do it for like oh, fixing up the oh yeah, so Fields won't run for his life, or they won't, or they will do it for the defense because the defense had up a lot of points every game, and and the Bears probably could have won a few more games if uh if the Bears didn't have such a yeah. The Bears have a few good players on defense, and I'll admit that, but. They traded Roquan Smith. They traded Robert Quinn. And at that point, we kind of knew that the season was just like, this has got to be good if, for them to even get a chance to go to the playoffs. And at that time, you know, they started one and one. They st won the season. They started the season out good with a victory. And then, in the second game, they asked to my least favorite NFL team, the Packers. My favorite NFL team is the Bears. But, my favorite college team is, is the, uh, but I also have this new and I think. Yeah, this is pretty big. This is, it's bigger than everyone's hands in the world, probably. Oh, um, anyway, back to the video. I'm just saying, like, they got a bunch of draft capital. DJ Moore, because DJ Moore is a pretty good wide receiver for them, and he's not had a so uh, now. Justin Fields has to perform like a superstar because he isn't like he just has like horrible receivers, horrible receivers, horrible receivers. So. I'm just gonna fix it on my punches. But so now he just has to throw it. He probably needs to throw over 4,000 yards this season because of Cole Komet was a top 10 tight end last year. 
Darnell Mooney was decent yesterday. I mean, he his his injury was pretty severe. Um, so he has to he has to season early. And it, 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 if Justin Fields gets a, a true wide receiver number one, then there is a lot of more pressure on Justin Fields, which he ha- has gotten. He has gotten a true wide receiver number one. And Dar- and DJ Moore. I keep saying Darnell because I'm used to saying Darnell Mooney. Uh, but in DJ Moore, DJ Moore, I mean, he, it's a weird talk because he is a very good wide receiver. He could probably be a top five, depending on how the QBs played. So, did tr- so there's a lot more pressure on Justin Fields now because they spent. Okay. Oh, they're better right here. But they spent a lot of more time and a lot of more draft cap. And I mean, they don't. They, they, the number one pick. They could have either kept it and just got a single prayer. But now, they get way more prayers than they did. So I gotta give props to the Bears. That was a that was a pretty good move. But now Justin Fields, he can't just, he can't, even though Justin Fields is my favorite prayer, I can admit that he can't just run it as much as he did last year if he gets DJ Moore because, you know, DJ Moore is a true number one wide receiver. So, you know, he got to be playing pretty good next year if if the Bears are gonna if the Bears are gonna have a hundred percent no, they're gonna keep it. So, I mean, as a Bears fan and as a Justin Fields being my pr- favorite player in the NFL, and I have a jersey of him, I I hope he stay. I hope he plays good next year. So they try to uh uh resign him. If he doesn't play good next year, though, then we got a problem because they might not re-sign him next year if he doesn't play good next year. So, you know, it's it's a weird topic. Yeah, as a Bears fan, guys, E Price is getting addicted right now. E Price is getting addicted to a real big cube right now. Anyway, uh. But, you know, he got pretty good next to for the, uh, for the Bears team and think about resigning him. If he doesn't, though, then we have a problem. Because he, he, the Bears probably won't resign him if he doesn't pray good. So, you know, that that is a very big problem for the Bears. And I hope Justin Fields plays good so then they can, it's n- not even that big of a question to resign. Also, subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Can we get to 50 by the end of the year, please, guys?